Thanks for watching, everybody. Welcome back to another Steve's World video. We are doing another shrimp food test. And as we're going to do another SL Aqua food, snow. So we're going to make a snow in our fish tank. As usual, I don't do the testing. The shrimp are going to do the testing. Remember, click that subscribe button below. I have almost 600 videos. So check out my playlist. New videos every week. Let's get started. Here's a close up of the bag. It says snow. SL Aqua. And as usual, on an SL Aqua food bag, the corner shows you what it's going to look like when you open it. I've tested a lot of SL Aqua food, but I also love their product. This is not a commercial, but check out. This is just some of the SL Aqua products I rounded up. It's truly my favorite brand for shrimp items. I'm not being paid to endorse SL Aqua, but if you want healthy shrimp, uh, check out some of these products. All right, let's get started with this food review. Let's open this up. Let's see what's inside of it. Soybeans. Looks like it's good for six months after opening. Was there more than just soybeans in this? Hmm. All right, let's check it out. Little gel pack. There's a big one. Let's see how easy they are to break. Looks like they crumble. They're fairly soft and, and crumble pr pretty easily. So I'm going to go ahead and put a piece in each tank and we're going to check back in a minute. Wow, did you see how fast that uh, dissolves? Is that why it's, maybe that's why it's called snow, huh? All right, so it's just been a few minutes. Whoa, first ones to attack is the Bloody Mary shrimps. There's a lot of activity going on in this tank. There's a baby rabbits now. Probably, I'd be cool to move him to a different tank. Put him over there, might be. I'm thinking about moving him. There's rabbit snail in in the dish. Whoa, upside down drunk rabbit snail. Should we help him? Or is he just eating upside down? We'll keep an eye on that guy. Two shrimps here. A couple shrimps checking it out here. dream tank couple just checking it out I wanted to see if the pygmy catfish would eat any so far not interested all right we're gonna check back in a little bit and see how this goes all right it's been 30 minutes and these fire red shrimp found the food Uh, I got quite a few babies in here now. There's a bunch of dwarf, or a bunch of pygmy catfish. None of them gone for the food. But the the blue dreams, they are they're uh, they really seem to like the food. They're going for it over here. Pumpkin shrimp here. Chocolate tank. We got rabbit snails and shrimp in here. Whoa. This is impressive. Well, all these Bloody Marys. How can I get a picture here? Oh, there's one or two Bloody Mary shrimps here going to town. Oh, they really like it. Rabbit snails joining the party. 
Uh, I could just make a video just of uh, my Bloody Marys. They're always fun to watch. Cherry shrimps woke up. Playing in the snow. Check that out. Pretty cool. Taipees and rural blues. Checking it out. Having a feast. And over here, you know how um, crystal red shrimps it can be kind of aggressive and grab the food and haul it off? I guess that, that's what's nice about this. It, uh, these flakes, they can just grab a piece of flake like this guy, take off with it. Um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna think this prevents a lot of fighting because the shrimps in this tank are all spread out with their own little piece of the food. That's impressive. It's only been about 30 minutes and this food is impressing me. Whoa, Otto. Maybe the Otto wants a piece of food. Well, we know rabbit snails like it. All right, we're gonna check back in an hour. Here we are, one hour later. That's about all the shrimp in this tank. If you saw one of my other videos, you see, I moved out a bunch of shrimp out of this tank. I think I had all females and I, I found a male here and I put him in here. Rabbit snails and chocolate. So let's see, we got three big rabbit snails. Well, there's an auto hanging out there. They like it. We already know. Bloody Marys are liking this food. That's a pretty cool. Look at all these cherry shrimp in this tank. Not much action down here with the blue bolts. A little more action over here with the royal blues and the Tybees. He's got a piece out there. Here we are in the crystal red, mist, my crystal red mixed tanks. It's going to town. This is gonna to be gone before no time. This food was a really big hit with these guys. Let's watch him for a little bit. You can see how there's pieces in the back there. It really spread out. This guy is on a piece of wood. He's got his little flake. It's really nice. Yeah, I got some auto action right there. Oh yeah, there's proof. Sucking it up. And all these guys spread out. All these have like one little flake that they're working on. Really cool. Here in the other room, we got the Blue Dreams. Oh, there's a little baby one right there. Did you guys see my baby Blue Dream video? I just uploaded that recently. Check that out from in the playlist. Uh, I still have quite a few buried females in this tank. I don't think the pygmy catfish were interested. Oh, I got more action over here on the fire reds. Uh, rounded up quite a few little babies here. These are from Lucas Bretts, his fire reds. Oh, I got a nice little batch of babies over here. It's really cool. They took a little time to get adapted to my water condition here. My water's a lot softer than his water. It looks like uh, with the babies, we're doing good. Over here, these are some uh, cherry shrimps. That's another tank I have. There's uh, about 70 or 80 cherry shrimps in this tank. It's dark right now because I'm working on algae, so I have a... Uh, 
a lid on the tank. Getting the light down to fight the algae in this tank. I think it's working. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Post your comments below. Have you ever used this? Have you ever used the snow food here? What do you think? I think it's pretty cool. Shrimps are digging it. Put a link um, where you can buy this. I got, if I didn't already post the link, I get it from Disco B. So it's a great place to order. As I said before, it's not a paid advertisement, but Disco B does ship their items out pretty fast. If I order on the, if I order on a weekend, I have it before Friday. I think every time. I can't think of a time I didn't have that. So, thanks for watching. Uh, you might want to order some of this and subscribe to my weekly videos, please.